Whether you have a small account on TikTok and you're not growing as fast as you want to, or you're just starting out on TikTok and you're trying to grow a personal brand or a business community. In this video, we're going to discuss the two best ways to go viral on TikTok with a small account in 2023. One of these ways might be more effective for your account specifically, so make sure you watch the video all the way through. Additionally, we're going to cover how you can implement both of these strategies to increase the likelihood that your next video goes viral. So the first thing that we're going to cover in this video is using the green screen effect. But before you move on and skip ahead in the video, that alone isn't going to help you go viral. You're going to have to use a specific background in the videos, and I'm going to cover four different things you can use in your background to help you get more views on your next video. So the first way to use the green screen effect is being controversial. So this would require you to use something in the background that is controversial within your niche. An example would be if you make videos about different sneakers or shoes, putting the most controversial shoe or sneaker behind you in your videos that all the people in your niche are going to know and they're going to be aware of. And then you're going to want to use those videos to give your opinion, which is also going to be controversial, which is great for going viral on TikTok. The second way you're going to use the green screen effect is to stop the scroll. Now, when I say stop the scroll, I really mean that you're going to want to use bright colors, bright images, or cool images that are going to get people's attention as soon as they scroll onto your video. That's going to hopefully stop them from swiping within the first three to five seconds. At that point, you're obviously going to need a good hook for your video, but that is going to give you an extra few seconds if it's done right. The third way is going to be trend jacking, and there's a few different ways that you can actually use this. It's all going to have to be within your niche, but if there's something that everybody is talking about within your niche, I'll give you an example in a second. What you're going to want to do is take a screenshot of an image or a news article, talk about it. Again, you can go back to being controversial. You can give it a controversial opinion, or you can just literally talk about something that's trending. And all you're really trying to do with this is leveraging something that's already familiar to your audience. Now, an example of this is with chat GPT. That's been super popular recently. And you might've noticed that every single video on your for you page, somebody is talking about chat GPT. What might be something interesting is if you use chat GPT to ask a question in your niche or just genuinely make some sort of statement that's regarding your niche with chat GPT, anything around it. It's trending so much right now that almost every single video that's including it is getting more views than it usually would. So that's the basics of trend jacking and it can be used with so many different topics. So it's one of the best ways to go viral consistently. The fourth way is pretty self-explanatory and that's going to be using the green screen effect for reacting to other people's viral content. Some people have literally built entire accounts around using this style. And although it's not great for building a personal brand, it is a great way to get a ton of views over and over again. The second method I'm going to talk about in this video is seven to 10 second videos. Again, this is really broad. So let me break this down into a few different methods that you can use before we get into the actual ways that these videos can be used. What you need to know is that 90% of these videos are going to be using a trending sound. A trending sound alone isn't going to help you get more views. It's the way that you use the trending sound. So all of these seven to 10 second videos, what I would recommend is that you use text on screen. Now, the more text that you use, the longer the video should be. The basic premise is that you're hoping that people are going to continue watching the video as the video loops, and it's going to help you get more watch time, which is going to in turn help you get more views. So in these videos, there's a few different styles that you can take. The first one is going to be educational content. Now with this educational content, what you can really do is use the beat of the audio. So if a song has some booms in it or ticks, whatever it is, then what you're going to do is pop up some text every time that happens. An example would be the three best ways to go viral on TikTok, And then every single time the song had a boom or a tick or beat, whatever it is, I'm going to pop up a new tip. The second thing that you can do is put up some sort of inspirational or motivational text. I've had a ton of success on my account using this, and it's a really good thing that you can do if you know who your target audience is and you know what really resonates with them. I've been able to use this to get hundreds of thousands of views and almost every single video that I use this style has gotten me over 50,000 views at least. The last and probably most effective method of using text on screen seven to 10 second videos is going to be putting something relatable on screen. If you know something within your niche is super relatable, then what you'll do is craft text, craft a message around that specific relatable point, and then use some sort of trending sound behind it and that's gonna be really good for reaching a ton of people in your niche. If your views are low right now, then you can also use this video right here to learn a few more tips to increase your views almost instantly.